Tony Blackburn, 79, took to Twitter yesterday evening to share his frustrations about the 20 miles per hour speed limit which is becoming increasingly popular to implement across the UK's towns and cities. Addressing his 103,100 followers, the former BBC Radio 1 DJ tweeted, Great news, more money for potholes. Now how about less money for this ridiculous obsession with 20 miles per hour speed limits everywhere? Who is it that decides that we motorists now are overtaken by cyclists? He asked incredulously. One of his followers, Robbie Temple, wrote, couldn't agree more. I'm a medical courier and have been overtaken by cyclists on a regular basis. Yes, it's ridiculous, Tony replied. Who makes these stupid rules? They won't own up. At this point, Simon Shooter weighed in with a stern warning, writing, careful Tony, that Vine Chap will be calling you out on here. Bring it on, Tony joked, understanding the Twitter user's reference to BBC Radio 2 journalist Jeremy Vine who is an outspoken advocate for cycling and its many benefits. Meanwhile, Harry Gray sarcastically penned, absolute disgrace. Who are these people trying to reduce motor vehicle deaths? I love the good old days when we could speed about without consequence. Don't miss. Sarah Beanie unveils very different look following cancer treatment, latest, Naga Manchetti unrecognizable in long-haired throwback pic, insight, legendary still game actor Stevie Allen tragically dies, update, bring back the horse and carriage, Tony joked back. Mind you, they went faster than 20 miles per hour. Other Twitter users took to the comments section to share their thoughts on Tony's post, with Nigel arguing, plenty of good research out there re 20 miles per hour zones. While Andrew commented, Oh Tony no. You're one of the good ones. Sick, well, it's a mistake to go after cycling. Really it is, added Ian, while John insisted, well said Mr B. At present, roads in London's central zone have a 20 miles per hour speed limit, and it has now been suggested that this rule be ruled out in cities across the nation. Other celebrities to criticize the 20 miles per hour speed limit have included Jeremy Clarkson, who has previously argued that the average speed of traffic on most roads is already low and that it is impossible to drive at 20 miles per hour all the time due to downhill stretches. Tony was the first ever BBC Radio 1 DJ when it officially launched in 1967 and has since worked for many of the UK's biggest broadcasters, including Capital London and Classic Gold Digital. He can currently be found on BBC Radio 2, BBC Local Radio, and British Forces Broadcasting Service. The star also won over the public back in 2002 when he became the first winner of ITV reality TV series Im a Celebrity. Get me out of here.